This is the journey of how I built sessionfix.com in a week, a SaaS web app that helps creators host paid seminars and group sessions online. I spent most of the time last year hosting seminars and live courses, and I just thought that the process of hosting them was too complex. Hosting seminars is honestly a pain. Inviting people, scheduling calls, collecting payments, and sharing call links is really hard. On the other hand, existing apps to receive payments are complicated to use or are not made for hosting seminars. <coughs> Manually, you spend way too much time confirming payments and copy pasting meeting links. So, for the past few weeks, I've been thinking of working on a really easy to use session hosting platform and started building a solution last week. This is the journey of how I did it. Hear me out. I want to create a service that allows experts and creators to basically fill out a form with the seminar details along with the date, time and price if it's a paid session. After that, they get a link which they can share with their fans. Their fans can then pay for the session from the link and join the session with a meeting URL. First, I wanted to validate if there's an actual interest in the product because that's what real chat entrepreneurs do, right? To do that, I bought the domain sessionfix.com and created a basic landing page. I then shared the landing page with yoga experts I know who host weekly sessions with their students and got a decent response. So I started building the web app. First of all, my tech stack is really old. I use Node.js for the backend, Express, EJS and MongoDB. I don't have much experience with React right now and I can quickly prototype around with EJS so I picked that for the front end for now. So after building the landing page, I also built a sign up and a login page with Bulma CSS, my favorite CSS framework. I, at the same time, I also used Passport.js for the authentication. This is the time that I realized that I'm spending way too much time slacking off, so I wanted to make myself more productive. I quickly created a new to-do list on Notion and started working on the dashboard as well. At the same time, I created a new form that allows creators to create a new group session or a seminar. For selecting a date with a date picker, I used a beautiful custom date picker by felixg.io. It looks so good and is really easy to use. I then made sure that you can view all the details of the seminars and sessions that you created. After building the basic dashboard, I started working on designing the seminar pages which will be displayed by the links created by the expert. This is the page that is shared by the expert to the students where they can register and pay for the event. So I had to make sure that it was really easy to use. I came up with a couple of iterations and finally decided on this one as it was really easy to register for the event. I made this page with Balma CSS as well. At this time, I also started choosing a payment gateway by which people can pay the expert. I chose Razorpay as my payment gateway for this app because I already have some experience in it and I also made a tutorial before on this channel so check it out on the iCard above. I also thought Razorpay was a good choice as methods like UPI are really popular here in India so I wanted to support that as well. At this time, I want to talk about the current business model. Session Fix is totally free to use for experts hosting an event. We only charge an extra fee of 10% to the attendee for each booking. So basically, if the expert is charging around 100 rupees for each ticket for the event, we charge the attendee who's trying to join for the event around 110 rupees and we take the 10 rupees as the fee for hosting it on Session Fix. After integrating the Razorpay SDK into our web app, I also choose Jitsi as the meeting platform right now where all events and video calls happen for Session Fix. Mainly because it's free and open source. I might switch to another API like Whereby or Daily.co in the future. The attendees get access to the meeting link right after they register and pay. Most of the web app is done right now, so I finished off the whole app and bought a VPS on DigitalOcean. I installed Ubuntu on it and hosted the web app on the server with Nginx. The app is live on sessionfix.com right now. You can check it out and let me know what you think about it. Thanks for watching the development process of building Session Fix. Next week, I'll document the process of launching and acquiring users for the product. I honestly want to thank you for the amazing comments. I know it sounds cliche, but your comments really make my day. If you need help with anything, just DM me on Twitter at HamishCH.